we developed this Pluriflow Active Clearance Technology System. And I'll show you how this works, but it's basically a sort of a standard chest tube that has a clearance mechanism to keep it open. And the mechanism has this guide wire that has a loop, and then there's a magnetic system from external to internal that allows you to move that guide wire in and out of the, um, of the tube. And so now, as the nurses can sort of strip and work their way up to the skin level that often leave a bunch of goo inside that's preventing the drainage, you can drain, you can keep it clear all the way to the tip. Let's see if this yet yeah, runs. And so this is kind of a quick animation, but you put your chest tube in in the operating room, and then that pleuroflow goes between the canister and the chest tube, and as you advance this up, then that guide wire with the loop sits up here, and then as the nurses actuate this in the ICU, it pulls that goo out, which allows that chest drainage system to stay open. So in the lab, when we looked at this, we started out looking at a 32 French pleuroflow versus a 32 French conventional at the amount of blood in a hemothorax model. We could get far superior drainage with the pleuroflow, but where I was really excited, we published this in the Annals of Thoracic Surgery, was that we could get better flow um, and, and drainage with a 20 French than we could with a 32 conventional using the active clearance technology. So for the first time ever, we'd shown that we could, we could get superior drainage with a 20 French compared to a 32 French if you just kept that lumen open while the blood was um, uh, draining in those early hours after heart surgery. Let me just show you a couple kind of side by side. When we first started doing this, we'd have surgeons say, well, I put two 32s or two 28s right in the front. Why don't I put one of the pleuroflow right next to, to one of ours and we'll just see how it does. And um, oftentimes we hook one up to one cheek canister and one up to another and look at drainage. And we could see a lot more drainage out of that pleuroflow. It's pretty obvious why when you compare it to that conventional tube. And, and this is you know, not every case, but a significant number of them when we look at this.